The Situations and Names of Winds by Aristotle Translated by Edward Forster This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Recording by Geoffrey Edwards Ventorum Situs et Cognomina Preface This short extract from the peripatetic treatise De Signis usually attributed to Theophrastus, is chiefly interesting for comparison with the charts of the winds given in the Meteorologica and De Mundo. The text used for this translation is that of O. Appelt, who has in the main followed V. Rose's edition. The latter is a great improvement on Becker's text. I have to thank Mr. W. D. Ross and my colleague, Professor W. C. Summers, for several suggestions. Ventorum situs et appellationes ex Aristoteles, Libro de Signis. Boreas, the North Wind. At Malus, this wind is called Pagreus, for it blows from the high cliffs and two parallel ranges known as the Pagraean Mountains. At Kaunas it is called Messus, the north-northeast wind. In Rhodes it is known as Kaunas, for it blows from Kaunas, causing storms in the harbor of that place. At Olbia, near Magudum, in Pamphylia, it is called Idureus, for it blows from an island called Iduris. Some people identify Boreas and Messus, amongst them the Lernatians near Phasalis. Caecius, the northeast wind. In Lesbos this wind is called Thebanus, for it blows from the plain of Thebe, north of the Elytic Gulf in Mysia. It causes storms in the harbor of Mytilene, and very violent storms in the harbor of Malus. In some places it is called Caunius, which others identify with Boreas. Apeliotes, the east wind, this wind is called Potomaeus at Tripolis in Phoenicia. It blows from a plain resembling a great threshing floor which lies between the mountains of Libanus and Papyrus. Hence it is called Potomaeus. It causes storms at Poseidonium. In the Gulf of Issus and the neighborhood of Rossus, it is known as Syriandus. It blows from the Syrian gates, the pass between the Taurus and the Rossian mountains. In the Gulf of Tripolis it is called Marseus from the village of Marsus. In Proconesus, Teos, Crete, Euboea, and Cyrene it is known as Hellespontius. It causes storms in particular at Capharius in Euboea, and in the harbor of Cyrene, which is called Apollonia. It blows from the Hellespont. At Sinope it is called Bericuntius, because it blows from the direction of Phrygia. In Sicily it is known as Cataporthmius, because it blows from the Straits. Some people identify it with Caecius, and also call it Thebanus. Eurus, the southeast wind. This wind is called Scopelius at Aegai, on the borders of Syria, after the cliff at Rossus. In Cyrene, it is known as Carbus, after the Carbanians in Phoenicia. Wherefore, some people call this same wind Phoenicius. 
some people identify it with Apeliotes. Euronitus, the south southeast wind. Some call this wind Eurus, others Amnius. Notus, the south wind, bears the same name everywhere. It is derived from the fact that this wind is unwholesome, while out of doors it brings showers. Thus there are two reasons for its name. Leuconitus, the white or clearing south wind, likewise derives its name from its effect, for it clears the sky. Lips, the southwest wind, this wind gets its name from Libya, whence it blows. Zephyrus, the west wind, this wind is so named because it blows from the west, and the west. Eopax, the northwest wind, at Tarentum it is called Sculatinus, from the place Sculatium, at Dorlium in Phrygia it is called. Some people call it Pharangites because it blows from a certain ravine in Mount Pangaeus. Many call it Argestes. Thrascius, the north northwest wind, is called Strumonius in Thrace, for it blows from the river Strumon. In the Megarid it is known as Skiron, after the Skironian cliffs. In Italy and Sicily it is called Circius, because it blows from Circaeum. In Euboea and Lesbos it goes by the name of Olympias, which is derived from Pyrian Olympus. It causes storms at Pyrrha. I have drawn the circle of the earth and indicated the positions of the winds and the directions in which they blow, so that they may be presented to your vision. End of The Situations and Names of Winds